Mm-hmm. So you don't get that crunch if you have to make it. Nope. Mm-mm. That's Tasha, that's Steph. Let's go ahead and fill in the rest. We gon' eat a little, crank a little. Our story time is the best. Have you LOL when you click play? No, nah, this ain't no clickbait. What's up, y'all? Hey, guys, it's Steph. And Tasha, and we back with another video. Before we get into the video, I want to ask you guys to please thumbs the video up. If you like it, share, comment, and subscribe. If you're new here, thank you for subscribing. Welcome to the family. If you've been here before, welcome back. Baby, tell them what we're doing. Today, you guys, we are doing a Chipotle mukbang. Yeah, mukbang. That's it. That's it. We will talk about what we have when we get into the video. We got to do a thumbnail, and then we're going to eat. Yeah. You ready? Yes. Then let's get into the video. All right, guys, we're back. So, today... I'm gonna let you say what you have because I don't know what you got, babe. Okay. I got a chicken burrito and I also have a barbacoa bowl and I have some hard and soft shell tortillas because I'm making tacos with those. And you see the sauces here, hot, medium, sour cream, guacamole. Yes. I have two chicken tacos here, you guys, with sour cream, guacamole, and cheese. And then I have a burrito bowl with lettuce, barbacoa, guacamole, cheese sour cream and so her bowl salsa. her bowl is pretty much um low carb mine is not because i got beans and rice in mine mm -hmm. uh yeah this mexican is my favorite food y'all so i'm happy as heck right now yes it is mm. it is her favorite and tasha honestly doesn't like chipotle like that no so we rarely eat it i like chipotle so i'm happy chipotle is cool i mean mm. it's all right Chicken burrito. All right. We had some trouble too, y'all. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. mm -mm. I love their lime or lemon rice, whatever it is. It's good. It's a lime. Lime rice? Lime cilantro. Okay. Mm. I'm already dropping stuff. She's gonna get it on my clothes though. This is so good. This is really good. Mm. Mm -hmm. Woo! I like the hot and the medium um sauce that y'all combined. Get in there. Mm. 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 Shout out to Cece from Chipotle. Oh yes. She got us some no oh, tell her, babe. Cece, I believe she was the manager. And the guy at the register was like, my manager said to give you guys some free chips and uh, guacamole. Oh, okay. That's nice. I was like, why? I was thinking maybe because we bought so much stuff. But when we were leaving, a girl came up to us and was like, what did she say? She I'm said, a fan of you guys or something, yeah, like, something that? like that. Yeah. So I was like, oh, okay. Thank you, Cece. Thank you so much. We appreciate you. We appreciate you. Hope you're watching. We actually went to a Chipotle near us in Santa Monica. They were horrible. They need you guys to go over there and train them, okay? Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. They didn't have no food, y'all. We waited 20 minutes for barbacoa, only to then not have chicken. Mm -hmm. Then we was like, forget it. We'll just get all barbacoa stuff. Why they ain't have no rice? I was like, uh-uh. <laughs> Let's just leave. So they ran out of three things while they were there. Mm-mm. Y'all are just doing too much. Way too much. This, these um, shells are not low carb, but whatever. They fit into her. They fit into my low amount. carb mm -hmm. budget for the day. Yep. Mm -hmm. And to be honest, I ain't gonna lie. If I want to go over my budget, I'm going to. I don't care. I'm not saying that I'm definitely gonna stick to low carb. I want to. It's in my heart. But sometimes God has other plans. Mm. God or your stomach? Your stomach. Okay. Cause I don't think God was trying to make you eat a donut earlier. <clears throat> it was she was trying to figure out how to fit it in. I was. I was. This is my taco. She didn't get the donut, y'all, but she was like, if I, I don't eat nothing else today, mm -hmm. can I eat one donut? I could probably have one donut. Mm -hmm. Because these are like 11. Uh, look. Mm -hmm. look at that, y'all. Mm -hmm. Was that good? Mm-hmm. Can you, oh, can I use this, baby? Mm-hmm. 
So I got some shells on the side because I was just like, I want the taco crunch. Damn, they gave me a whole piece of roast beef. Shit. Whoa. Cut that sucker up. Hold Jesus, on. Jesus, look at all that. Mm -mm. That's like way too much. Mm -hmm. I want this hotter. Anybody that gets tacos from Chipotle knows their tacos get soggy so fast. So that's why I got the shells on the side so I can just make my own. Mm. About to go down. I'm going to let you bite that. Oh, thank you. I'm going to watch you. Do we ever do a... Uh, yes, he did. Mm. Mm -hmm. So you don't get that crunch if you have to make it. Nope. Mm -mm -mm. That looks good. Here you go. Nope. You can make one. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Ooh, this would probably be good dipping your cheese. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Go ahead. Mm -hmm. Be my guest. Mm. This needs a little bit. I need to at least have one chip, y'all. Just one. One chip ain't gonna hurt me. Mm. I'm probably going live after this, y'all. So I hope y'all got your notifications on. Why is everything better with bread? Mm -hmm. Or a carby product, you mm -hmm. know? Yeah. Ain't right, like crackers. Why we can't just eat the meat? Mm -hmm. We want crackers too. It's always something. Yep. That always. That you're not supposed to have. Yeah. That you need. <laughs> mm -hmm. mm. I mean, because I love this cheese. This cheese don't have no carbs. Or very little. And. But I can't dip anything into it. You can dip your finger into it. <laughs> I'm dipping the chip, y'all. I sure did dip my finger in it. Mm -mm -mm. So if you're new here, thank you for checking this out. Mm. And if you're not new, thank you for sticking around. Absolutely. Y'all got us to where we are. 200. We got us. All of us got us to where we are. Mm -hmm. We are almost 200,000. Huh? 230. Yeah, I think we're going to hit 230 today. So yeah. thank you, you guys. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. And we are still going to do the subscriber appreciation month. Ooh, shoot. Um, y'all know we just been running around. So mm -hmm. before this month is over, it's coming. Before July is over, we're gonna announce the winner of the two hundred with two hundred dollars. I think. Yep. Two hundred dollars. Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh, I'm getting kind of full. Mm, you are? Mm hmm This is good. Mm -hmm. We generally eat for a little while, you guys. And then we'll have a topic later. Today we didn't discuss which topic we're going to do. So I'm going to try to look up something. Right now. But, you, so, it. you, ate it. you ate it. You ate it. You ate the food. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. That burrito is really good. All right. Hold it down, baby, while I look for a topic. Mm-hmm. You can't even eat nothing that's chompy. You want me to look for the topic? Oh, no. I don't want to. Whew, I'm hot. Nope. I'm going to eat this, y'all. Look, right by the mic, too. Oh, I haven't been eating like this, so I probably don't even hear me eating. Mm -hmm. And Stephanie got it to her because she conceded. Shut your ass up. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, y'all. Now I have people have been sending us a lot of topics on Instagram. If you want to send one, send it to at Steph and Tasha. Um, so yeah, I've been taking snapshots all week. So I have a lot of potential stories to talk about. So I'm going to read this one because we get some topics like this um, pretty frequently. 
it's not this exact story, but it's the similar issue, you know? So let's talk about this today. Um, so this one, okay, so she says she really wants to start a YouTube channel, but she's very insecure about herself, mainly her appearance. She gets judged all the time, and she thought about doing a mukbang channel, but she feels like people are too judgmental and rude. Um, that's pretty much it. So she's saying, basically, how can she get over, I guess, the fear of being judged and mm. her insecurity. I, th I think that the biggest part of getting over caring about being judged is getting over that insecurity. The insecurity is what makes you care about people judging you. Okay, because I had it too. I had it. I was had a huge fear of people judging me, and it would keep me away from doing everything I wanted to do in life. Mm. So I'm like, I can't do it. I'm not going to be good enough. People are going to think that I'm stupid if I don't say the right thing or do the right thing. I thought about that so much, and it hindered my whole entire life because I just stayed in a comfortable place all the time. I never did things I really wanted to do okay. because I just felt like I wasn't going to be good enough. And I think I was judging myself more than anybody else. Right. You know? Mm -hmm. I agree. Being on YouTube, you definitely gonna get judged. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you. Okay. Yeah, that's what I wanted to tell her. <laughs> people are gonna judge you. People are gonna talk about you. There's no mm -hmm. way around it. Mm -hmm. People, whatever, excuse me, insecurity you have, other people may, like for instance, I have a big forehead. Everybody sees that I have a big forehead. But I don't think that I'm ugly or I don't think that having a big forehead, I don't think there's anything wrong with it. I don't think there's anything wrong with anything. Right. Um, so nothing, it doesn't bother me. I grew up with deaf parents. People talk about my parents. I got you saw that kind of, and so I had to build, a, 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 a create a, a tough shell and say, you know what? Everybody has something. So that person that's telling you, exactly. you have something, that person that's saying, oh, you're fat or, oh, you have a big forehead or, oh, you're, you're, you're ugly or you're too light. You're too dark. Some, they have something that they're insecure about too. Mm -hmm. Everybody has something that they're insecure about. These yes. bullies. Don't even pay attention to them. Nobody's perfect. We all, and then who's to say that being big, being small, being light, being dark, being this, having a big forehead, having a small forehead. Stephanie has, uh, Stephanie came up with this little thing. I like to steal her stuff all the time. But who's to say that that's what is beautiful? That's just what exactly. society claims is beautiful. Exactly. You know, on another planet, maybe everybody is walking around with gigantic exactly. foreheads. And that's like the beautiful thing. And a person with a regular size forehead is looked upon as ugly. Exactly. You know? These people out here judging people are judging people based on this standard that society has come up with to say that's not the right thing to have and mm -hmm. this is. Mm -hmm. Which is not even a true thing. Whoever had the power to create these standards and judgments has basically brainwashed people who follow, follow them. Mm -hmm. And even if you do think about it, to have the gall to talk crap about somebody mm -hmm. is a whole nother thing. Yep. You know what I'm saying? You just, uh, something is wrong with you. You're an unhappy person to talk crap about somebody, mm -hmm. you know, and make somebody feel bad anyway. But yeah, the, all the standards that, that people are trying to live up to, and I, there's some things that I don't like about myself. And if there wasn't a standard out there for certain things, I probably wouldn't feel that way myself either. Like, mm -hmm. I don't like my arms. They're really big. But if, let's say big arms was a shit. Girl, I'd be out here every day. Like, who? You know what I'm saying? I would be out here every single day. You I would? Still, so you think that if big arms was a it, thing, then you would show them? I would feel better about it. I show my arms now. Yeah, you Because do. I'm like, I can't care about them. You know, I got over that. Okay. But I don't like them. You know what I'm saying? But okay. if big arms was a shit and I was taught that all my life, maybe now I'll be like, girl, my arms all up. Hey, mushy all up. You know what I'm saying? But okay. I don't feel that comfortable with them. I wish they were different. You know what I'm saying? And there's a lot of other things too. But guess what? I had to say, you know what? I got to live this life. Right. I gotta live this life. I gotta be happy when I'm out every day. So forget this stuff. This is what I got, and I'm gonna be happy with it. I think when you're a younger That's person it. too, though, I think younger people have more insecurities than than older people. Yeah, so for sure. it's like sometimes when you're a child, it's hard to. We can tell you all day long, but. With children, it's mm -hmm. hard not to be insecure because children are evil. Right. I'm sorry to be, I'm sorry, y'all. Not mm -hmm. all of y'all. I ain't talking about the good ones. I'm talking about some kids will say anything and don't care how you feel. They don't think about it. You know, that's why so many kids are hurting themselves because other kids are brutal. Mm -hmm. That's true. I mean, I was called fat and I wasn't even fat. As in, a, in high school, I wasn't even fat. I was just bigger than the average, not even bigger than the average. I think I was like average, mm -hmm. but there were a lot of really small girls. Mm -hmm. So like the average girl was like fat. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So I had people say, and I had cellulite and stretch marks when I was little, um, younger. And so I had people talk about that. I had people call me fat. And I don't know. 
Honestly, I think I handled it well, but it did bother me. Mm -hmm. You know, I, but I wasn't crying about it. I was just like, fuck you. I mean, you got a fucking stanky ass breath. You got stanky breath. Like, I would talk shit back next time. Right. You know what I'm saying? But I had to be strong because kids are brutal, like you said. Mm -hmm. If they don't like something about you, wear something to show it even more. Yeah. Make sure they think you are confident as heck about it. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was going to say. This little line that I always say, fake it till you make it. Mm -hmm. um, if you are feeling insecure, you don't want to show that insecurity right. to people because people don't deserve to see you vulnerable. You can let people that you know love you see you that way and see you cry and see you hurt and talk to them about it. But when it's someone who you know doesn't have your best interest at heart, no. You let them think that you are the most confident thing exactly. on this planet. And they feed off of you being affected by it. So if you don't show that, they're going to move on to somebody else who's yes. being hurt by it. Yes. If, you, if you act like you don't care, they ain't like, oh, this is not my yes. torture to her. It's not even working. So let me go to somebody even else. Even with the negativity. If you come back at them with negativity, which you you are going to at some sometimes, mm -hmm. they're going to come, come back again right. because they are or feeding feeding off that. Of it. Mm -hmm. They like that. Well, one of her questions also was how basically how she deal with it on YouTube. You know, she she's basically being pushed away from wanting to start a channel because she thinks people are going to be rude and judgmental. They yes, are. they are. <laughs> they are. They definitely gonna, you got to have some thick skin to be a YouTuber. Trust me. Mm -hmm. We get negative comments every single day. The positive way outweigh the negative, but you gonna see stuff. Yeah. And I can't say that I don't ever 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 get uh, mad or offended by stuff because I do sometimes. Um, what do I do? I talk shit back sometimes. Yeah. But most of the time we don't. Honestly, a lot of times I laugh at it. Some of the shit be funny. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But um, a you got a lot of it is funny. I'm you, not gonna lie. Yeah. You know, but it's still rude. Just because it's funny doesn't mean right. it's not rude. We'll exactly. crack up because I mean sometimes we know. Oh, this is a kid. Yes. When it's an adult, I think when I can tell it's an adult, that's when I get a little more irritated. Yeah. Me too. I'd be like really. Me too. You I'm a like, grown woman, girl. Exactly. Sit down. But it's like, you're, no matter what type of person you are, you could be the most perfect person ever. You're still going to get judged on YouTube. Yeah. Don't matter what. There's nothing you can do to not. There's people. Every channel has hate. Everyone. Okay. No Doesn't matter, matter what you're doing. There are not, I'm sure there are uh, Christian channels somewhere yeah. that's getting hate from exactly. people who are atheists. You cannot please everybody. No, yeah. We are not going to ever be able to please everybody. People talk about you eat too slow. I eat too slow. She eats too fast. Mm -hmm. She takes bigger bites. Why your bite so little? Why you pick on chicken? Why you eat the chicken too? too you eat the chicken like whole. Mm -hmm. That's greedy. Yeah. I pick it off. Something wrong with me. Yeah. No, matter, no matter what we do. So we got to just let it, let it go. Okay, do what we here to do. I'll be flirting with the the people we do collab <laughs> oh, yeah. with. You know, I'll be, mm -hmm. be doing stuff on the side. Stephanie, what else? What do you do during the collab? So Stephanie, oh, don't I, like nobody. Yes, I always look irritated. Yeah. or uncomfortable <laughs> on the collabs. It's always something, you guys. So you that's not necessarily it. negative. That's just perspective. Right. You know, that's just perspective. But but it's always something. It's we, some, we, we artists always, always yeah. know it's gonna be something. So if you want to do a YouTube channel, ignore that. If you can't handle it, block them. We right. don't block many people. You got to really be offensive to, for us to block you. Mm -hmm. But if you don't want to see that, block the I, people. I, I, it's about 25 people on the block list. They are. Yeah, I'll <laughs> put them there. But anyway. So that's it. Do you have anything else to add for the people? Good luck if you if you try to do a YouTube channel. Shit, ignore the haters because you're going to have some. Yeah, that's it. Do your channel. Exactly. Don't worry about what anybody yeah, says. Yeah, worry about the people then, that like you. If and you, you know what I'm saying, you get it on with. Yeah. Sorry. And if you're doing, it's okay. If you're doing the channel and you're seeing negative comments and it's really affecting you then you can stop i mean you can always stop you don't let people who don't even know you you know talk whatever i mean you they can say whatever they want but you know if you can't deal with it then quit your channel yep don't let other people's thoughts and opinions stop you from doing from from going for your goals that's my that was my main thing i i was hope, letting my fear of that hold my hold me back from everything i want to try to accomplish and you can't do that because you're not gonna be happy right okay so, I wasn't sure if the mic was on, y'all. It's on. Okay. You ready to get on the video? Yeah. I'm so full. Let me do the outro, babe. Yes, okay. All right, you guys. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. I'm, I'm Stephanie and she's me. Oh, okay. <sighs> I'm still eating. <laughs> All right, you guys. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you guys think. Um, Tap that notification bell. Oh, set your notifications to all so you'll be reminded of every upload, live stream, or premiere. And until next time, guys, only good vibes. That's what I really? Yes. Only good vibes. Yes. Really? Oh yeah. my god. Until next it. time, only good vibes. Wait, <laughs> and the thumbs up.
That's you, baby. Sometimes she be like, peace. Like, no, babe, I do not be like, it's one only thing. good vibes. Yeah. Really? <laughs> like, until next time, guys, only good vibes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me do your outro. All right. Thumbs up, y'all. Um, go ahead, the vlog channel up, up here. Um, uh, notifications. <laughs> go ahead, note. Oh, you be like notifications uh, for the live streams, um, the, the uploads, and the supremes. And uh, <laughs> peace, y'all. <laughs> Who's was better? Wait, why is it on country? Oh, I don't know. You, you don't always country. do a country. Uh, right. You always do a country. country. All right, we out of here, y'all. Yeah, that's it. Bye. Bye.